Hello and welcome to Milford Performs. I'm Brian Hopkins. And I'm Michaela Hopkins and welcome to our final episode of Milford Performs. <laughs> the past I've shed so many tears can't believe I've lasted this long I see now that I'm wrong the only way out of here is the way I've avoided for all my life there's so many things I want to say but there's too many things still in the way I'm lost please help We're here with Erin Wheeler, theater girl. And she really likes to act, sing, and even uh, perform just so, uh, solo. Erin, thank you so much for coming out tonight. Thank you for having me. Now, the, 
You were just recently also with uh, uh, Cinderella at the Milford High School production. I was. Yeah, but you've been in plenty of other productions. Definitely. <laughs> <laughs> um, Milford Performing Arts? Yes. Yeah. Uh, what shows have you been in? Um, I've been in starting, I don't know what year it was, but Sound of Music. I did Tarzan, Bye Bye Birdie, um, the most recent one, that Wizard of Oz. Mm -hmm. So I've been there doing their big, big spring shows for about five or six years, I mm -hmm. think. Yep. And then I've been doing one-week camps with them mm -hmm. since I can remember, since yep. I was a little girl in kindergarten. <laughs> now, you also did Susicle with them. I did. Yep, that and was that's the first time you were here on our second our very our second show, so things come full circle. Oh, yeah, definitely. <laughs> you were a little shorter then. You weren't, you weren't taller than me then. Bit. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, that, so... Um, and you've also done uh, shows with the Encore uh, Repertory Theater in uh, Woodsocket. Yes, I have. Stadium Theater is so much fun. Mm. Being part of a big production on like, it seems like professional theater even though it's just a community theater. Mm -hmm. The stage and the audience is just a completely different experience. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, very definitely, very definitely. Now, um, so you've, you've been doing this as long as you can remember. It's something you want to keep doing. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, um, so what do you have coming up? You know, uh, you're just you're just a sophomore now, so it's a, not, you, this is not an interview for college. And <laughs> <laughs> just what do, you, what do you think you're going to be doing in the future with it? Um, I have nothing really coming up in the recent future. <laughs> for, um, but I'm going to try to stay at MPAC and Stadium Theater when I find the time to. Um, I'm definitely going to be involved in the drama and the musical at the high school next year. Mm -hmm. And in my future in general, I don't know if I'm going to pursue this. It's a risky business, but if I can get the courage to, I definitely will. But I definitely want to keep it as a hobby. I want to keep playing piano and mm -hmm. singing and doing theater for as long as I can. <laughs> okay, terrific. Well, folks, just keep your eye open for Erin, the theater girl. Let's see, or even her Facebook handle right here. Uh, She'll be around. You'll see her at the high school. You may see her at a few other productions and, and in the near future and a little further beyond that. Erin, thank you so much for coming out to Thanks join us again. today. Who's he? Who's he with his marry me? With his ring and his marry me? It's a nerve the goal. This is not, not what it was meant to be. How could I ruin it all with those two words? I thought I knew him, thought that he knew me. When did it change? What did I miss? A kiss when I thought all along that we were meant to find frontiers. How could I be so wrong? How I need, how I need my sisters here. If I could share my dreams, what were they for? I thought I promised meant that we would never change and never part. Together, we'd amaze the world. How can I live my dreams or even start when everything has come apart? I thought home was all I'd ever want. My attic, all I'd ever Nothing feels the way it was before, and I don't know how to proceed. I only know I'm meant for something more. Need to know if I can be astonishing.
I will be fearless, surrendering modesty and grace. I will not disappear without a trace. How shall it start riot? Be anything but quiet. Christopher Columbus, the sun sheep, has died. Should I go down if I stay too long in trouble town? Oh, yeah, well, you let me, baby, you pay me in two, but you move me, honey, oh, yes, you do. Now and again, get that feeling. Well, if I don't win, I'm gonna break even. Rescue me, should I go wrong? If I dig too deep, if I stay too long. Whoa, yeah. Baby, too. But you move me, honey. Oh, yes, you do. Be the boy in the corduroy pants. You be the girl. The high school dance. Run with me wherever I go. Just play dumb, whatever you know. Oh, yeah. You wreck me, baby. You break me in two. But you Oh, yes, you do. Well, you let me, baby. Break me in two. But you move me, honey. Oh, yes, you do. Well done. Well done. Well, she was an American girl, raised on promises. She couldn't help thinking that there was a little more life somewhere else. After all, it was a great big world with lots of places to run to. Yeah, and if she had a dive, try. Kinda cold that night. She stood. 
Too alarming now to talk about. Take your pictures down, shake it out. Truth or consequence, say it aloud. Use that evidence, shake it around. Don't the best of them bleed it out While the rest of them peter out Truth or consequence, say it aloud Use that evidence, race it around they
Back in uh, the fall of 2013, we had our first episode of Milford Performs. Our studio was not nearly as complete then as it is now. No curtains, so a lot fewer lights, and not nearly anything like the audio we have now, and a whole lot smaller cadre of volunteers than we have now. But there was one thing we had in the fall of 2013, our first episode, Justin and Ray, and they are back with us today. Guys, that was great as always. Lesser talent. That's another thing you had. <laughs> <laughs> 2013. Small pool to pick from. Oh, boy. <laughs> Thanks for having us. It's awesome being on the last show and the first show. That's, it's an honor. So That's thank you. That's kind of cool. Really, really appreciate you guys coming out. Congratulations on five years. Hey, How many episodes? Uh, I think they're 51st right wow. now. That's yeah, amazing. Excellent. Good job. Yeah, and uh, you know, we're, we're going off because Mikhail's going off to college, and you know, I don't want to try to do this myself. <laughs> I need somebody to clip my mic on for me. <laughs> I totally understand. Yeah, that's right. She's good at that. <laughs> that was a great run. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Um, but you guys are still around, and you guys yeah. are still doing all your, uh, your bar gigs. Let me just re for, for those two people out there who don't know who these guys are, <laughs> let me read you something from their Facebook page. Uh, Justin and Ray are an acoustic duo based out of Milford, playing your favorite bar songs and your favorite, at your favorite hangouts. Some things never change. You guys are just always, <laughs> no. always having the fun. You know, it's yeah. t-shirt and uh, baseball hat rock. That's, 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 that's right. really all it is. That's and right. Now you've expanded a little. I, did. I have sleeves now. <laughs> <laughs> I, I bet, Congratulations. I, <laughs> I'm a big boy now. Five, five years, you know. Yeah, five years. I was, I was actually going with the tailgates down. Oh, yeah, like okay. Yeah, yeah the, the country band. Yeah, that's yeah. going. That's good. That's good, too. Yeah. Justin and I are working on something, too, for the near future. Oh, great. More electric and uh, full band. Wow. Yeah. We do a lot of side things together. Oh, yeah. No, so, yeah, amped up productions. Yeah, yeah that's, that's going. And yeah, you guys have been keeping the music scene going around here. We're trying. Yeah, yeah we try. It's, it's got a life of its own, it seems. Yeah. Um, you know, but we try to keep the local, the social going up with the tradesmen the first Monday of the month. Yep. Um, you right know, here for more info. Go check it out. <laughs> um, but there's so many great bands around here. There's so many musicians, and there's so much you know great local talent mm -hmm. that you know. I think would you say like every Friday, Saturday, there's like 15, 16 shows. Yeah, within five, seven miles. Something yeah, like check that. it out uh, right here. Ray's got it up for you every every Friday yeah, night. Just the local lowdown. Yeah, the local lowdown. If you got nothing else to do, it's not Ray's fault. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you. There you go. Yeah, Ray's still over at uh, WMRC, which is now my favorite. My FM. My, my FM. FM yeah. One oh. 101.3. 101.3. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, and then Justin's still operating Justin uh, Red and Tech Services. So yep. you can check it out over there on his Facebook page. Uh, if there's one thing we do at this show is we cross promote. As you, everybody <laughs> knows, we cross promote. That's the whole point of the show. Much appreciated. Because yeah. music doesn't pay the bills. So no. we have to talk about the real stuff we there do. There you go. The real, the real stuff pays the real bills. There you go. But that's, that's what we've always tried to do here is showcase the local talent. Keep you guys uh, uh, in the public eye a little bit. Thank you. And you, you guys have really worked hard to, to have a scene that when we have out of town acts on our show, they come in and say, "Wow, <laughs> Milford is something else for yeah. local music." We can't believe that we could come here, play our songs, not just covers. Yeah. If, if we want to play covers, we can play covers. People will listen to them, but they they want to hear our stuff too. Well, it's, from what I understand, Milford was a hot spot for music, yeah. um, not like with the big band mm -hmm. era. And then the 60s rock yep. came through. Your dad was a musician. Yeah, yep. Joe Perry's from the area. Yep, back in 73. Yeah. So yeah. it used to be thriving. And yep. um, it's nice to see where it is now. Oh, yeah. It's, it's, it's great right now. So I, I think we're going to leave it in your hands to continue <laughs> the tradition. All right, absolutely. See how much longer I can stand them. <laughs> yeah, <right. laughs> like an old married couple. There you go. <laughs> Well, check out the old married couple right here <laughs> on their Facebook page. All the dates are coming up, PJs and the, the tradesmen, a few other places. Check them out. Keep them going. Keep going with the local music. Thank Ray, you. Thanks, Brian. Justin, thank Brian, you so much for to be here. Thank you, Michaela. <laughs> thank you for watching the final episode of our fifth and final season of Milford Performs. We just wanted to say thank you to all the performers who have been on our show for the past five years, the dancers, the actors, the, the singers. We wanted to say thank you to all the crew members who have been directors, sound technicians, camera people on our show. We wanted to say thank you to the staff of Milford TV who's been so helpful, the people who support Milford TV, and of course, our viewers at home.
you make our show what it is. We appreciate your support so much. Thank you. We couldn't have been able to do it without you. And I want to say a special thank you to Michaela for putting up with me for five years. <laughs> so for one last time, thank you for watching Milford Performs. On Milford TV. Good night. <laughs>